Leo, I'll kill Beto. <laughs> <laughs> I would um, kiss Rico because I actually wanted to kiss him on Saturday. Oh yeah, you said drunk. that. Yeah. And then I'll marry you because of his mind. <laughs> hey guys, so here with me is Ifuenada. Hi. How's it going? <laughs> uh, good. I'm exhausted. I mean, it's been interview, interview, interview all day, but I am fine. That's the life of a superstar. You Rico, know. help me. Oh. <laughs> I, I, I was just coming from some place where I went to get smoothie, and I was almost. It was too much, yeah. Aww. Little people want to take photos. I stayed in the car most of the time, but they still found me out, you know, and I granted them the photos that they wanted. But it's been good though. I'm excited. Okay, okay. So what's next? What's the plan? Oh, what's next is as soon as I'm done with the interview tour, I want to release my short film. I'll probably even do that this week. I have a short film to the Broken Virgin, which I won an award for um, Best Actress last year. I produced and I also wrote the thingy. Um, I'm going to release it and then I intend to um, shoot the feature length film of it. Mm -hmm. Before I went to the Big Brother house, I was already getting investors. When I'm getting more offers, I just want to sit down, articulate everything. I just know the ones that I'm going for. And then I'm also going to be um, working on my own TV show. So before now, I had a show on African Magic All About okay. 18 Plus, uh, but I, I wasn't producing it. So I want to produce my own show. I want to um, check out the offers with you guys, sponsorship that I'm getting. Mm -hmm. And see so how I can actually own my own thing because I've been on this since I was 19 and I'm 26 this year. So okay. I think it's high time that I do my own stuff. Mm -hmm. And there's also, you know, exploring music somewhere along the line and also getting into business with like my, my hair. I don't know if you watch the show, yeah. you know, most of the time it was on my natural hair. Most mm -hmm. of people have been asking me how I was able to grow the hair, you know, mm -hmm. that long in such a short period of time because my hair is about a year old, but it's over 12 inches long. So um, I want to. Um, Incorporate all of my ideas with regards to hair into commercial business and okay. just you know, just stop. I mean, break into Hollywood. I've been saying that. I'm very okay. passionate about it. All right, interesting stuff. So now that you're out of the house, what are like the <laughs> most interesting things that you've seen on the internet? Like, ah, you know, people have said about you that I'm a man. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> this time, you're a man. Well, because you're you're a gym rat. Yeah, yeah. Because I work out. Mm -hmm. They said um, that I am hating on Bam Bam, and that. Oh yeah, let's talk about that. And that um, <laughs> what else? And it's because no guy looked my side, so I'm envious of her. That she's way more talented. My goodness, there's no competition wow. in this thing now. You know, <laughs> several hate comments. You know, lots of people are calling me she devil. Ah, no, you can't be as incredible as CC. So but let's <laughs> let's move on to the Bam Bam talk. So the live um, eviction show when yeah. Ibuka asked you about what you thought about the compilation in yeah. the house, and you said um, right there and then that you don't know what Bam Bam is doing. Like thing as Teddy A said from the beginning. Yeah, had a girlfriend yeah. and a baby mama. So, yeah, yeah. Is that why people think that? You no, know? no, not exactly. Um, I think it was more of like the paper thing we did yesterday. So, uh, before then, you know, before that, I didn't have issues with my mom in the house. Mm -hmm. But during the Pepsi Rock the Man challenge, where they um um hit my heart, I didn't know where my hearts were, and they put their hearts where you know my hearts were actually initially. Mm -hmm. I I I got I was really pissed because she's someone that I hold in highest esteem. Mm -hmm. I I would say that before then I thought like she had like the highest you know moral standards and things like that. So when when she did that, I felt I was very disappointed and I got emotional and I forgive, but sometimes I don't let go easily. So I think that was my problem, you mm -hmm. know. So yesterday when people asked me who I I thought the uh, if it, there was the fakest house or was faking the house, there was only one person in my head and it wasn't for anything malicious, you know. Mm -hmm. You know, her name came up and I was trying to explain why, but I guess um, um, you didn't cut across well the way that I, the, my choice of words. And so lots of people just went on the paper page and they were tearing me, there are over 1,000 comments there now. Wow. Tearing me apart, you know, saying <laughs> that I am a hater. I am, but that's not the thing. I mean, she's someone I really respect a lot. Mm -hmm. I, I apologize for holding on to that grudge for a very long time. I was just really disappointed. I mean, mm -hmm. being someone that I respect a lot. But I mean, if you're not, if I don't respect you, I wouldn't even care. Like, you know, do whatever it is. Mm -hmm. So, but I think my, my being emotional came from a place of respect, you know, and how I held her in high esteem. Mm -hmm. But um, I don't hate Bam Bam. I don't want Teddy. I don't want any guy in the house. If I wanted a guy in the house, it would have gone after it. I mean, I can be a super flirt if I want to be, but that's not the kind of picture I want Africa to know me for. So I don't hate Bam Bam. You guys, please forgive me. You know, my choice of words were, uh, were not right, but come on, guys. Calling me she devil, saying I'm bitter. Really, have you met me? <laughs> have you met her? Okay, so talking about copulations. So people think, a lot of people have commented and said that they think you left the house because you were not coupled up. What do you have to say about that? Um, Anika was trying to do, I don't know what she was doing, but then it seemed like uh, Angel was interested in her, at some point it seemed like Rico was interested in her, 
but she left the house yeah mm -hmm. so i don't think it's about i think for me like i always say it was really of god for me to leave because i went in there not wanting to copulate with anyone i mean why should i i mean who love help you really yeah <laughs> so yeah so the fact that i left was because like if you asked me that day i obviously didn't get enough votes if i did get enough votes i'll still be there so mm -hmm. i don't think that might be in a relationship but not had anything to do with my getting evicted no okay what about leo do you think leo sort of put a damper on you on your stuff well i house. wouldn't say that i mean my partnership with leo was the most fruitful because with him we won the pepsi rock the match absolutely and in my in my book you guys already won like really ah that was also <laughs> that. That. <laughs> people were like oh they already won so they don't need that help <laughs> people that you understand i saw comments like that on the internet yeah. and with leo um I w we're in the same group for the heritage bank thingy that mm -hmm. we did and we also won so i wouldn't say leo sort of like dampened my um chances at being in the big brother house longer i just felt that um i don't know what it was we just didn't get enough votes mm -hmm. we just didn't get enough votes but i really appreciate those who voted us and um, who made our time in the house that long so yeah that's it okay um i have a couple of questions from twitter so wow okay <laughs> okay somebody wants to know if you have feelings for miracle i don't know where that came from <laughs> <laughs> you guys kidding me i'll turn up this girl right? <laughs> is always milo milo spoiling my son i mean in, in, not in a bad way He's just playful, yeah? Mm -hmm. And Mir Miracle is like that with every girl. I mean, he said to me that initially he never liked me, but he started going in front of me towards the, you know, the end of my stay in the house. I don't have feelings for Miracle. I mean, I just like him like I like every other person in the house. Okay, but if you were to couple up with anyone, any of the guys, who would you have been? Um, no one actually. No one? So like nobody did I like, for you? I like older people and I'm 26 this year. So, I mean, like one of my ex is 37 this year. So, like a 10 years difference thing. Yeah. I mean, mm -hmm. it's not like I wouldn't date a younger guy who has a lot sense. of you know sense let's put it that way but I, I went in there not looking for love and well most people were around my age i think the oldest in the house was angel and he was just 32. so if who do you think is gonna win um who i i wouldn't say who i think is gonna who win. who are you who, rooting for yeah i'm rooting for alex obviously i'm rooting for alex really? I, I feel like yeah she has a good heart and she deserves to win i mean she i think i feel like she really needs some money and then she would put it to good use if she wins yes <coughs> Wait. Ah, that cup. So, <laughs> so yeah, that cup. That Alex cup. said something in the house. She said she gave the money to Leo. Yes. I think what she meant to her. say is that yeah, I mean because she probably feels that Leo has as a businessman, he has more experience with management, money management, you know, and finances, and that's why she said that it doesn't mean that I'm winning this money for Leo. No, mm. her family needs the money. She needs the money. Yeah, because she said she doesn't know what she's gonna do with the prize money if she won. She literally said that. I think her head. I, we need to slap. <laughs> we go beat her, Alex. <laughs> You go top that thing. You know, they top that. You want lose fan? You understand? People, a lot of people. If you need to check the Bella Niger comment, it's crazy. People are like, it's Yo, crazy. who are you? The same person that said her family are in trouble. You know, like financial that's why trouble. I feel like she needs the money because her dad has been sick for a while now. Come on, girl. Alex, not big. You need to do better. <laughs> I for don't slap me now, but you did. You understand? Yeah. And what do you think about all the crying? Like, ah. Uh, I think I think that also threw up some of our fans. Like I definitely, think, a lot of people are upset. Like, ah, uh -uh, it's a game that you came here to play. Like, you didn't come here. To she's a very that. emotional person, and you know, um, she doesn't really know how to put a hold, a hold on her, 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 her emotions. Sometimes I think she's a work in progress with regards to that. But she's very real. She's very real. She's very real. She's very talented. She's a writer, you know, and she has the potential of being a TV presenter and a whole lot more, you know. And I, she's young, so let's support her, please, guys. Mona, forgive her. She's not gonna cry at that again. You know, Mona, forgive my big. <laughs> Alright. Okay, so kiss, marry, kill. Kiss, marry, kill. Rico, Leo, Bito. Uh, Rico, Leo. I'll kill Bito. <laughs> <laughs> I would um, kiss Rico because I actually wanted to kiss him on Saturday. Oh yeah, you said that. Yeah. And then I'll marry Leo because of his mind. Aww, I mean, these aww. are the options they gave me. So yeah. yeah. I get it. Yeah. Alrighty. Thank you so much for your time. This was super fun. Yeah. I wish I could have chatted some more, but I need to get out of somebody's hotel room. So thanks for having me. Hi. If 